What's going on, beautiful people? Welcome back to another Hawes Capital video. Uh, today's video, I want to show you guys how to interact with the Parallel Finance Test Network. Um, as we know, we are able to now finally view our rewards. Um, soon, we'll be able to actually start using those rewards. We'll be able to start using our C dot, which is the liquid version of a staking dot token that we got back uh, for contributing to the Parallel auction. Uh, so once you get all those things um, and the ability to use it, I want to make sure you guys all know what to do. Um, so I want to just go ahead and show you basically uh, how to do the test net. Now it's fairly simple. And if you decide you want to go ahead and play along as well, um, everything that we're going to do is test net token. So nothing is actually going to cost any money um, to actually get the test net tokens. You will need to go ahead and uh, join the discord. When you join the discord, there is a um, a room that says faucet and testnet. Uh, all you do is go there, paste your address. They'll send you some testnet tokens and you can exit the discord or you can stay in the discord if you want to. Um, totally up to you. All right. All right. So we're going to go ahead and you're just going to click down here. You're going to do enter testnet. All right. And when you're in the room, guys, to go ahead and receive the tokens, you may need to go ahead and just update your wallet. So when you go over to your wallet, just go to settings um, and you're going to want to change it to as soon as my, my wallet stops acting crazy. I don't know why it's just my wallet or the mouse. All right. Go allow use on any chain. So that's what you're going to want to switch it to. So that way you can get the test net tokens and it will send it directly in case you're on like the individual polka dot or the parallel uh, wallet individually. I would just recommend switching to any chain. So as you guys can see, I've already got test net tokens in there. I've already got a little bit of uh, some stuff going on that I've done as far as wallets and swapping and uh, borrowing and lending. Uh, so basically how it works. What you'll need to do is when you do the test net, they're going to send you some uh, USDT, HKO and Kasuma. Uh, so you're the KSM. What you're going to want to do is deposit it first. So we're going to deposit it into the network. So what happens here, and if you look back on the first video I did for you on showing you how to claim your rewards or to view rewards, I had for my wallet, I had one dot sitting on other networks and then I had 10 liquid dot plus my parallel, which is sitting on the parallel network. We have to deposit funds onto the parallel network. So what we'll do is we'll deposit half. We'll go ahead and deposit 25 KSM into parallel. So we've already got 25. It's going to ask us to go ahead and um, just go ahead and sign that. We'll go ahead and remember that for the purpose of this video. So that way I don't got to keep doing that. Um, give it a little second, guys. It's fairly quick. Uh, it should update fast. Uh, and we will have deposited. There we go. Transaction looks to have been updated. Let us refresh our page right now just so we can get and be sure. Give it a second. All right. Uh, once it's deposited in there, then you'll have the option in which you can go now and you can do the borrowing and everything else in which you need to do. All right. So let's go over to lending and borrowing. All right. So at the lending and borrowing, what we want to do is we now we've got some KSM in there. We want to go ahead and supply some KSM to the network so we can borrow it. All right. Because once you deposit on parallel, the funds aren't actually committed um, into the protocol for DeFi borrowing and lending yet. They they may just be sitting over here as far as deposits. You actually have to supply after you deposit, all right? And you also need to turn on collateral if you think that you're going to be wanting to use these uh, specific tokens towards your collateral, all right? So first we supply. What we'll do is we'll go ahead and we will supply a thousand or yeah, we'll supply a thousand USDT. Uh, hit confirm on that one, confirm again sign the transaction, give it a couple of seconds. Once that transaction's approved, what we're gonna do is now we need to go ahead and activate so that way we can confirm we wanna use this as collateral. It's gonna require another signing of the transaction. So there we go, we've just signed the transaction, all right. You can see I've got a $500 loan in which I'm going to show you and I'm going to repay back out. Uh, since I've taken that loan, it's already earned like 30 cents of interest uh, due on it so far. All right. So there we go, guys. We've just now increased our borrow limit. We've supplied more uh, funds into the network. We are earning some USDT. Uh, and now let us go ahead and let us 
go to loans, all right? So here at the loan section is where you can go ahead and you can decide to borrow whatever it is you want to borrow. So let's go ahead and borrow, we'll borrow 10. All right, submit that, confirm. And again, just playing with the network and messing with the network. That way, once it goes live, you feel all right and you feel comfortable. Uh, it's pretty straightforward, like many other DeFi borrowing and lending platforms I've shown you, not too much of a difference right here, uh, but just making sure that you're getting comfortable and familiar with the additional steps, such as depositing, then supplying, then turning on collateral and things like that. Uh, let's go ahead and repay a loan so you guys can see what that looks like. We'll hit submit. We'll confirm on that transaction. There we go. And we'll pay back off the little baby loan that we've got outstanding on there for $500. And then I'll go over to the staking side and I'll show you that as well. Um, unable to stake for this video in the test net because I don't have <clears throat> balance low. I'm sorry. Not quite sure why my balance would be low. Let's repay. All right. I'm gonna repay the 500 exactly, submit, confirm. I think it tried to pay more than I actually had. I'm not really sure why I would have said balance low. All right, so we went ahead, we just dropped and repaid that. There we go, our repayment is done. All right, that's finished. And then staking over here, guys, um, there is no, uh, I don't have any ability to stake right now. Uh, so I don't have anything to stake, but basically uh, the staking, once it goes live, you'll be able to come over here, commit how much you wanna stake, uh, you'll have your selection of validators down there and you just select your validator. <clears throat> uh, it will normally have the scores for you. So you'll see the scores that let you know uh, which validators are you know, healthy and good and going to stay away from slashing versus the validators you may want to use caution on because they may end up causing you to lose tokens by getting slashed uh, because they're not validating and keeping up with the network. Uh, but I just wanted to show this to you guys. Real simple overview. Uh, not too hard. Um, as you can see, that KSM that I actually uh, deposited finally just reached and hit over there, took a little bit of time. Remember, we deposited when we first got into the video, 25 over there, and it didn't show up right away. Just give it a little time, guys. Remember, it's still a test net um, that's using. Uh, but I just wanted to show you guys this test net and show you how to use it. Uh, so just as an overview reminder, uh, to get started, um, just use your Polkadot.js wallet. I would switch it from, um, you know, whatever relay chain you're on to uh, a support support for all networks um, or we send and receive for all networks go into the discord request the test net tokens from the faucet uh, and then come back here and play around guys that's really all to it not too much uh, but i wanted to share that with you and i hope that video is helpful for you guys uh, again we're all starting to receive our parallel rewards now so it's getting close to that time when we're going to actually be able to go through and uh, participate in some of the steps as far as like lending and using our c dot guys i hope this video is helpful and i'll catch you on the next one